So here's the all 40 overall team that I'm starting with. And here's the greatest basketball team ever assembled. Let's see how this first series goes. And before you watch me get destroyed, that sounded kind of crazy. Be sure to subscribe to the channel, like the video, all that fun stuff. Appreciate it. And in game one, we lost 152 to 20. Great start. LeBron with a triple double. Curry with 20 and 15. And my leading scorer was a bot with seven points, shooting three for 10. Not bad. And to no surprise, we get smoked in game four. Let's see if I can score 40 overalls. Little screen action there. Hit the roller. Ooh, actually, might have an angle. Hey, okay, we'll take that garbage. Well, now I don't feel as good about it. It was on rookie. Okay, well, that, yep, yeah, okay. Well, we're not going to count that one, but I'm still going to feel good about the bucket. Man, I love 2K, huh? It just, <laughs> just, what a great game. The greatest team of all time can accept their championship now, but I will be here soon to break down this team by building the best team ever to beat the best team ever. Well, now it's time for our first spin of the tier one. We're going to get ourselves a role player, 76 to 80 overall. All right, let's see what I can cook up. We're going to take this opportunity to get one of the best defenders in the NBA, Jaden McDaniels. Let's see if Jaden moves the needle. And in game one, he did not. They still scored 160. And Jaden had a solid game, 18 points. I guess guarding this team isn't easy. And to be fair, Jaden's probably not even guarding anybody. If I were this Laker team, why would I go at Jaden when I could just go at the bots? Yo. There's six seconds left. Why is there always one guy from my team celebrating? I don't understand this. Does this count as a win? <laughs> like, I, hey, listen, I'll take it. Well, Jaden had a rough game, and uh, I mean, yeah, he, like, he's got no help out there, so I don't blame him. All right, time to get our second player off the tier one wheel. It's going to be a bench one. We're 71 to 75. I got to really dig deep here for a player who's going to actually help us. We're going for mind games here. Let's bring another great defender in Patrick Beverly. We're not going to outscore this team, so defense is our best option. Let's hope Pack can get Steph ejected. And at least their scoring is under 150. We're on the right track. Track. And Curry only had six points. Look at Pat Bev. He didn't do much on offense, but I'm not asking for that. We didn't do that bad. And as long as we somehow pissed off Steph for at least one game, I think we won the mind game. I don't know if that'll actually matter, but you know, I'm taking every moral victory I can. And MJ, like again, you just keep, I don't know why he keeps doing that. You should like uh, fix this 2K. I don't know. <laughs> this, this feels like something that should be fixed. Well, Curry was pissed this game. Yeah, he popped off. Now let's go ahead and get our final player from the tier one wheel. It's going to be a star. 86 to 90 overall. Okay, we have to be very smart here with this choice. We need someone who's going to be a spark plug to this team and take that Steph Curry matchup serious. Let's bring in Russell Westbrook. I've made a pretty big effort to try to get in Steph Curry's head. I should try worrying about that MJ or LeBron guy. And in game one, we only lost by 107. And Westbrook's trying to get a triple double, but couldn't do it. And we got cooked by less than 100. I was going to add Draymond or Ben Simmons instead of Westbrook, but I've used those two guys so many times for videos that I want to use somebody else. I've never picked up Russ for any of these. There goes my fourth championship and a finals MVP. How about that? And Westbrook so far has had the best game of any player I've had. 23 and 4, we'll take it. Here is our first spin of the tier two wheel. It's going to be a role player, 76 to 80, we'll take it. Now it's time to get LeBron's head. Let's pick up one of the best defenders in the league, Mr. Dylan the Villain Brooks. There was a good big man. I take one, but we're playing my games. He only lost by 90 this game. That's not bad. Nobody's going crazy for the Lakers. And uh, Dylan, I get there's nobody else in this team, but 18 shots. I don't know about that, man. We only lost by 70, but we're still a long way. Let's get a little Dylan, Jaden McDaniels action. Ooh, Dylan, spin. Pump fake, pump fake, pump fake. Hey, get to the line. This was easily our best game. Not much to really brag about, but uh, yeah, we'll take it. And now let's get our second spin of the 2-2 wheel. It's going to go ahead and be a bench when we're 71 to 75. Okay. We're not going to out physical Kareem or Will. So let's bring in a big man who could space at the floor and Channing Fry. And since we have five players, I'm now just going to play those five guys and not play any bots. There's no point. Let's see if we can play in one close game. Well, we got smoked in this one. Will Chamberlain decided to not miss today. Looks like that spacing helped out. Channing Fry going one for 10. And we're going to lose this game by under 70. Now I'm not going to lie to you guys. I have built a disgusting basketball team. But if we can win the mind game and carry it on to the next guys we get, then I think we'll actually have something. But we gotta win the mind games first. Again, the last time, they should, like, fix this. Yeah, this seems like a pretty concerning thing. Anyway, Westbrook easily having his best game. 31-6 and 7. There we go. And here is our last spin of the tier 2. Well, it's gonna be a starter at least. Okay, an 81-85 overall player can actually help. And we need someone who's gonna be a game changer. So let's bring in Victor Webinyama. Wemby should be a real difference maker on this team. Because if he's not gonna do it, I don't know who else will. We lost game 1 by under 7. Which, again, is not much of an accomplishment, but we'll take it. And we lost the final game by 60. We're getting closer. I like the foundation we've built so far, but I'm not sure what this team's identity is on the actual basketball court yet. We got some guys who can play some tough defense, but then we have, like, Channing Fry on Will Chamberlain, and it's like, okay, well, what do we do there? We'll figure it out, though. We got a long way to go, and Wemby's having a great game. It is now time for our first spin of the tier three wheel. It's going to be a superstar, 91 to 9 overall. If you could have tolerated the tiers of the wheel, you got a higher chance to get the better players. You get the point. Let's see if we can get our superstar. We need a versatile defender 
player who could score at any given moment. Let's bring in Boston Celtics superstar Jason Tatum. And we're now going to have Wemby play the five, so JT's going to run the four. Let's see if Tatum can put up a fight. And in game one, we only lost by 17 points. It looks like Tatum was a difference maker, man. 35, 9, and 10 playing some great defense as well. It all works out. We got blooded in game four, but Tatum was the right pick. Look at Westbrook's finals MVP. You earned it. There goes Tatum with another great game. Let's go ahead and get our second player of the tier three. It's going to be a star. 86, 90 overall. That's pretty good. Let's go ahead and pick up a young star in the making. Can get a stop and a bucket when you need it. Let's bring in Anthony Edwards. We have a super athletic backcourt. I love this. Let's see if we can steal a game. And we only lost game one by 11 points. And look at Tatum. 40 and 9. Westbrook 22 and 12. Wemby 22 and 13. And Ant 21. And we haven't stolen a game yet, but we're close. We still need that GOAT type game changer guy. And our depth sucks. But there's still we got a lot to work on. But we're getting closer. Look at Tatum, man. He has been phenomenal the moment he joined this team. And here is our third and final spin of the 2 3 wheel. It's going to go ahead and... Oh, I almost got a GOAT. But okay, we're getting a role player. We do need some depth. Let's bring in one of the best defenders in the league in OG Ananobi. It's not a flashy pick, but OG knows his role and I expect him to play well in it. Let's see what we can do. We got smacked in game one. What happened? Tatum had a rough game, but our defense should not fall off that hard. I guess we'll just call this one a rough series. Listen, man, it's not easy to beat, you know, 15 of the best basketball players ever. So we can't get impatient. We got to take it one step at a time. Wemby had a great game. This is just a bad series overall for Tatum. And now for our first spin of the tier four, it's going to be a go, 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 finally a go. But it's got to be someone who's not currently on that team. So I really got a game plan this. We're going to take the most recent NBA champion, the man who averaged a 30 point triple double in the playoffs, and a potential three time MVP, Mr. Nikola Jokic. My bad. I was going crazy on it there. But anyway, Jokic is our center. So that's good. I think we can actually win a game. We got blown out in game one by 23. Jokic had 16 and 13. I usually do more scoring, man. Well, uh, Jokic did not help that much. It might be time to move off Westbrook as our point guard. I, you know, I've loved having him, but it might be time. Wow, Westbrook actually had a great game. <laughs> okay, wow, I kind of feel bad now. Should I have taken and beat or something? Like, yo, because you got to play better, bro. We got a star 90 overall potentially. All right, let's see what we got. This team needs a certified sniper. So let's take one of the greatest shooters of all time in Ray Allen. We didn't really have a sniper, so I'm glad we got one. Can we please win a game? Now we're losing by 50. What's happening? Where did the fall off of this team start? Oh, we finally won a game. I wasn't sim casting because I didn't think any of these would be close, but we actually somehow won one. So I guess we're on the right track. We just got to be more consistent. Oh, wow. Finally, they get the championship trophy of, you know, what they deserve. It's been like, how many attempts were we on? Like our 10th attempt? I still think this team needs a better point guard. So let's see if we can get one. Our second wheel spin of the two for one. It's going to be a star 86, 90 overall. So I'm probably not going to upgrade from Westbrook, but it's still, you know, it's good. So we're going to bring in a 7-3 sniper and Chris Dats Porzingis. I moved some guys around and now Porzingis is starting at our four spot. Let's keep stealing wins. We got blown out in game one. I guess I am forgetting that this team is pretty good. And we couldn't get a game this series. And even though we didn't get a win, I still think we're on the right track. So I'm not too worried. I just need a couple more superstars and we'll really make this a series. And these guys are playing well, but not Jokic. I, I don't know what's going on with Jokic. And here is our final spin of the tier four. It's going to go ahead and be a superstar. This might be a time to get a new point guard. I need someone who's going to go bucket for bucket with the guys on the other team. And there's not many guys better than Luka, so let's go with them. I just realized I did four spins of that. My bad, but you know, I'm not going to get rid of Luka, so I don't want to spin on tier five. <laughs> We're okay with this. Well, we lose game one by 12. Not bad. LeBron played a perfect basketball game. And Jokic and Luka carried. Okay, I guess we'll take it. Hey, man, we can only get so much better. There's still room for improvement. But at the end of the day, this team has Steph, LeBron, MJ, Shaq, Will. You know, there's only so much you can do, but we're going to try our best, I guess. But we're just not there yet. But now we have our first spin of the Tier 5. Well, it's going to be another superstar. We're going to get ourselves the LeBron stopper. One of the greatest defenders of all time, Mr. Kawhi Leonard. And I moved Jason Tatum to the 2 just so Kawhi can guard LeBron. Let's see if we can make this competitive. Well, we got smacked in game 1. Gave it our best try, but uh, yeah, still not good enough. I haven't even had a chance to hop in and play. Just need a couple more players, man. We're almost there. I know it doesn't feel like it. You're like, how much better can we actually get? But there's there's plenty of room. And it's now time for our second spin of the tier files. It's going to be another superstar. At one point, people said this guy was better than Tim Duncan. Not kidding. We're going to go with prime Anthony Davis. Again, you can't really get much better than this. Let's do our best. Well, we lost game one by 20. That's not bad. Steph with 31 and 13. We actually blew him out here at the end of game four. We'll take it. We're not going to win a championship, but the moral victories matter. And we go down here in game five. There's got to be a way to beat these guys, man. I know it seems impossible, but like, it's just nuts. Got to get lucky. <laughs> let's, let's be real. Well, I guess we'll go ahead and keep spinning this tier five wheel here. It's going to be a GOAT, finally. We're going to get ourselves another NBA champion. Give me the Greek freak. I like having Tatum come off the bench now and have Kawhi start the two. We somehow take game one. Tatum with 28 off the bench. Exactly what I'm looking for. I got a chance here down six in game two. Everyone got the way. Out the way. We're just going to Luka every single time. If they don't help, I'm doing it. Oh, dude. 
Por was that Porzingis? He got cooked. Little Porzingis pick and pop, maybe? Porzingis out. Three. Oh, wait. I got fouled there, man. Nothing on that? One last chance. Nope. We're done. All right. We're getting out of here. I had a chance to make it 2-0, but I just, I, I just didn't love what we had. Game three. I got a shot. Yoke. Come on, Yoke. Come on, Yoke. Oh, I was only in two. I thought I had it. Come on, LeBron. Come on, LeBron. You can choke one. You can choke one, LeBron. All right. We got Kawhi on Curry. That's where we got to go. Go to work. Go to work. Go to work, Kawhi. I'm here. I'm here. Nope. No. <gasps> no! LeBron foul baiting, bro, in the finals. You're so weird. You're so weird, LeBron. You're so weird, dude. Come on. Tatum, step back. It's not going in. I, I can't believe that. That's so nasty from LeBron. Well, we had a shot, but I guess I blew it. And we lost in game four. Wasn't much we could do there about MJ. I guess I got a shot here. Whoa, whoa. There's a mismatch. Everyone got the way. This is big Giannis. Big Giannis, baby. Oh, you could have got that ball. Oh, good block. Who was that? Who blocked that shot? I owe you everything because that was a cr No, Kawhi. I got Steph. I got him. What are we doing? What are we doing? 12 seconds. I'm going to wait for the last second. Everyone got the way. I got him. Luka. Luka magic. No timeouts for LA. Man, if I just didn't blow that one game, man, with the LeBron foul bay, we'd be up 3-2 right now. But I guess we got to do the impossible. And the impossible will not be done. It's all good. I like what we did here, man. We, we got a real shot here. So let's go ahead and keep spinning this tier 5 wheel. We got ourselves a superstar. Let's pick up a superstar in the making who has turned himself into one of the best players in the league today. Bring me Shea Gilgis Alexander. The game wants us to start Shea, so I guess I'll let it rock. Let's see what happens. Well, we went ahead and blew him out in game one. Well, it was mostly a blowout until the end there a bit, but we still got the win. And they bounce right back in game two. Shea's playing pretty good. Keep it up. We got ourselves another blowout in game three. We can really win this. Look at our guys hooping. Tatum, Jokic, Shea. I guess starting him was the move. Another blowout in game four. We scored 47 points in the fourth. Nah, Shea might have actually been my best pickup of the video. And we just got to hold on here to close him out in five. Does this mean the modern era players are better than all the old players? And we got Jokic, Tatum, Shea here, Luka, like, we got it done. It's a little anticlimactic because I didn't even have to play in any of the games, but we just blew them out on all of them, so what was I supposed to do? And I guess it's only fair since we stole, like, 15 of their championships, they can have one of ours. So, you know what? It's okay. You can enjoy the win with us. It's all, you know, fighting games at the end of the day. This is the Jokic I've been waiting for. 31, 11, and 16. AD, 22, and 11. Giannis, 19, 6, and 10. Shea, 17, and 10. Well, there you go. Beating the best team ever. Let me know what you want to see next. Goodbye.